Hola, what's up guys? Buenas noches. John here and it's about two in the morning on the way back. And uh, so tonight I had uh, one of my guys come out. The reason I'm out is because one of my guys from the, the group just closed his first fucking deal and it's a huge deal for the credit card business. And so I told him, I said, hey man, when you close that deal, I was just joking. I was just joking. I said, hey, when you close that deal, come down and we'll fucking celebrate. And so he actually fucking closed the deal just by walking in cold, not knowing nobody and showing him the credit card machine and shit. He closed the deal cold. And I said, when you get that app, fucking come down, we'll celebrate. And I didn't think he would actually come down. He said, yeah. And he actually came down and fucking right after, right after he closed the deal, he came down. And so since I didn't think he was coming down, I, I, I invited baby Neverita over to my house and she's been waiting at my house for me while I went. I told her, I said, Hey, I'm going to go accompany him real quick. I'll be back in an hour. It's now fucking uh, past two in the morning and I'm on my way. I'm like, it was, this was like at 10, 10 p.m. I said, I'll be back in an hour now. It's fucking two in the morning, four fucking hours later. I feel bad. But anyways, it was a good celebration. And one of the things that I wanted to share is I had a viewer like talk to me when I was like at the register paying for the bottle. He's all, hey bro, I saw your channel and uh, he, he's all, I'm here now. And I said, what, you by yourself? He's all, yeah, I came by myself. This is my first solo trip. He's all, I've been here three times. This is my first solo trip. Pretty young guy and uh, he's from Florida. I said, you flew out here from Florida? He's all, yeah, man. He's all, we were looking at strip clubs in LA cause they went to LA for some convention. And then they found this, someone suggested that they go to this fucking place. And so they found me from there. And I said, that's cool. And he was telling me about how the his buddy got fucking jacked by the cops in front of the club. They took his cell phone, his passport, money, everything. So he's never coming back again. And it'll, they, he only went out to go use the ATM and the cops jacked him right there for everything. Usually they don't take everything. And usually they don't fucking, usually they don't fucking jack you in front of the club, but this time they did like in front of the ATM. Not directly in front of front of the entrance, but like where the ATM machines are, they fucking jacked him. Took his fucking cell phone, his passport, his cash, and fucking let him go after that. But, he said his friend is never coming back because of that. And so I'm like, dude, they took everything, like even his passport. Normally they won't do that. They'll just take your money. But this time they took all of his shit. And so he was telling me that story. And I said, I always tell the people, man, I always tell you guys that are watching, do not, when you see a cop coming down the street, do not cross the street. Do not do anything. Go back in the fucking club. Go in, duck into a store, whatever you need to do and get away from the cops. Hola, what's up guys? Had to interrupt the video to bring you guys an important announcement. A lot of you guys watching, I've been receiving tons of messages from guys that are virgins, that haven't been laid yet, that want to get laid, and maybe guys that have already been laid, but they're not getting access to girls where they're at, so they want to get laid still. You know, these guys are getting taken advantage of, reaching out to escort strippers or whatever they're reaching out to, wasting all that money. If you really need help that bad and you want to do it that bad, reach out. I'll help you guys. We'll discuss whatever it is that you're facing. It can also be other stuff. Maybe you're heartbroken and need advice or need something to help you get over that heartbreak. Maybe you have a wife or a girlfriend where you feel like she's cheating on you or things just aren't the same. I can help you analyze the situation and get over it i've gone through a lot of relationships already with girls from all over the place all over the world different places you know so i've seen all the things that they do been in long-term relationships so i know what a marriage feels like i know what divorce feels like i haven't been divorced but 
in a long-term relationship to where I felt like divorce pretty much. And so I've seen a lot of people go through it and I can help you guys that are going through these type of things too. If you need help, maybe like going to another place, I can put you in touch with people in different places in part of my network or find people that are viewers as well that can help. That's why I'm doing this to get the word across of the things that I can help you with. Not just that, if you own a business and you're accepting credit cards and you're still paying the fees, you don't got to pay the fees no more. You're pretty much just throwing your money in the trash. You're better off just using it on yourself, splurging, taking a vacation, enjoying like this in a pool in a tropical location somewhere where there's nothing but palm trees around and tropical birds, that kind of stuff where the weather's perfect. You could be doing that instead. Or if you know, have some friends or family that own businesses that are still wasting their money paying the fees, you know, I'll be able to help. So I can help with a number of things and I'll be glad to you know, put you guys in the right direction. Same thing if you guys got want to go to Costa Rica, I got friends out there. Cancun, I got friends down there. Philippines, I got a lot of friends out there. So if you guys need help on any of that stuff, reach out. I'll be glad to put you in contact so that way you can have a better experience all around. All right, talk to you guys soon. Adios. And once they pass, then you can fucking... Once they're gone, once they're gone, he said these guys... He said these guys, the cops fucking saw him, saw them, and they passed, and they fucking made a U-turn, and then harassed the guys and fucking robbed his shit. So wait till they're fucking completely gone, guys. Before you decide to pass or cross the street or wherever you're trying to go, do not always fucking make sure that the cops can't see you and you can't see them. Then you're safe. You know? So, yeah, that's what I wanted to share tonight. Awesome night. Celebrating the victory of one of my guys and it's gonna be life changing. Close this huge deal. He's gonna start making his fucking residuals and shit. Hung out with one of my girls that became corrupt. She started and uh, saw her destiny. That I saw her, I was like hoping I would see her tonight. And she was there. We actually ran into each other. I saw her tattoo that I can't, that no one else would ever fucking have. And I pretended I was a client or like a, just a dude going behind her and and she saw my shoes and she knew it was me. I kept hiding behind her because she was facing the stage and I came up behind her and started grinding on her and then I kept trying to turn her head to see who it was but I kept going to the other side and ducking and hiding and uh, she saw my shoes and she knew it was me. <laughs> You know, I appreciate the outreach, the comments and the emails. And if you can share these videos with a friend or also at the very least, uh, just give it a like. It doesn't cost anything or take more than a half a second for you to click the like, because then what it does when you click like, YouTube will suggest the videos to other people that have the same interests as you. So that's kind of like how the whole algorithm works. And so that, that goes and helps a lot too, you know, like if you're not writing comments or sending donations or whatever, pressing like and writing a comment helps greatly as well, you know, cause then YouTube will know that you find it useful and that it'll start suggesting, it'll know that it's a legit video that can help somebody and it'll start suggesting it to other people that are kind of like watching the same things that you're watching. And I said, oh, okay, cool, let's go have a drink. And so we had a couple of drinks and I told her, I caught up, we caught up, it was her birthday uh, just a couple of weeks ago. And it's my birthday coming up and I'm flying out today to the surf spot with my ex. She called, my ex called me and said she wants to spend my birthday with me and I already invited Bebecita, a huge fucking drama, guys. She, my ex like wanted me to cancel my trip cancel with Bebecita so that I could go with her and she's all who you want to be with her or me I said I want to be with you and she's all we'll cancel it I'm like I don't know I'll think about it I'll let you know she's all what either you want to go with me or you don't she's all cancel it and so I told Bebecita she's fucking pissed and upset and sad and she's all never invite me ever again to anywhere that's how pissed she is and I said, I'm sorry, but you know, I, I wanted to go with my girl. And I was hoping for that. And it actually came out. I didn't invite her, I didn't call, talk to her or whatever. She reached out to me and said, I want to spend your birthday with you. And that's kind of like weird how that law of attraction kind of works. But anyways, yeah guys, 
I just wanted to share that what happened tonight and for you guys to watch out because that's what might happen with the cops guys so always try to fucking hide get out of there go back in and wait till they're gone and then go wherever you're gonna go every time you see the cops stay away from them they're gonna jack you and rob you all right guys i'll talk to you guys soon adios pura vida buenas noches bye guys it's finally here i got the jedi group open and i got a website put together for all you guys that can reach out to me instead of sending me an email the website's 420john69.com and pretty much everything you need is listed out on the links above and the links of links below so if you're interested in a jedi group if you're interested in uh getting help with a trip relationship advice credit card service real estate affiliate programs pretty much anything that i'm talking about business investments it's all on the website so that way you guys can help me help you a lot faster that way i don't miss out on any of the emails and it'll help me stay in touch with you guys even if something happens to the channel or the instagram or whatever if everything gets taken down or blocked by the platforms i'll still have a way to get in touch with you guys so go ahead and go to the website and pick whichever link that you need help on and fill out the information and i'll get back to you as soon as possible look forward to seeing you there all right talk to you guys soon adios pura vida all right guys, so I'm putting together these groups, the my Jedi Master Inner Circle. So there's gonna be two levels to it. You're gonna have the Jedi Masters, which are the guys that are making 100K or more per year at least, and have been well-traveled, have a lot of experience, and know of different places that we can go to experience and find beautiful girls and be able to share amongst everyone and give advice to other people as well. And then we're also gonna have the young Jedis that maybe aren't as experienced or just starting out in life or are young and don't really have much money, but they wanna live this lifestyle. They're being inspired and they wanna start and learn and be able to communicate with each other. So that'll be the second level. And of course the Jedi Master level can will be in both so that you'll have the Jedi Masters also helping the young Jedis by answering questions uh, for people that are new and then the Jedi Masters, what we're going to do is have like trips maybe once a year where all of us Jedi Masters come together and have go to a destination where we'll be able to experience all of this together and share and network and share financial advice, how to make money. It'll be how to make money, how to deal with breakups, how to meet girls, pretty much everything that you're seeing on my, vid my videos that I'm teaching, we'll be able to network and do it in person and put, put together these groups and meetings for people and kind of be my me as the connector, connecting all of you guys together because I'm getting all these messages from people from all walks of life in different parts of the world. And a lot of you guys tell me that you don't have anyone to share these experiences with or share your stories and share all the knowledge that you've uh, accumulated throughout the years. And once you communicate with me, it's like you're spilling your entire story because you're so excited to tell someone finally because there's no one else you can take. You can't tell your friends, can't tell your family, and there's no one you can ask questions. There's no one you can uh, share these intimate details with. And so I wanna bring you guys together with other like-minded people that are watching my videos and kind of wanna live this lifestyle as well. And let me know which Jedi master uh, or Jedi part level in the inner circle that you wanna be in. There's gonna be either the young Jedi or the Jedi masters. And the Jedi masters is gonna be for you guys to join that's the, the screening process and then we got the young jedis for flux that way it's affordable and the fuck to screen out obviously if you're doing well there isn't much and then it keeps out the people that aren't serious it's kind of like the how to weed out the people that aren't really real and of course there's going to be moderation and there's going to be like con content moderation where i moderate who gets in and interview the people that want to come in to make sure they're real and that way everyone that's in the group is actually there because they want to be and that they share this similar outlook on life and want to live this type of life and level up even more, make more connections, make more friends, kind of like me and Tim, the 72 year old that you've been seeing interview and other people you haven't seen in my videos uh, that I hang out with. It'll be kind of like being into the inner circle and make, make these kind of bonds that will last a lifetime and these kind of memories that we can share together and have some awesome adventures together. You guys will be invited once you pay the entrance fee and then we'll get you in. All right, guys, that's it. Adios. Pura vida. You say adios, baby. Adios. Uh, <laughs> bye.
So like guys, if you uh, coming down here to Cancun, Playa del Carmen, I have friends down here as well that can take care of stuff. If, if you're headed down to Costa Rica, I got friends in Costa Rica that can help take care of the stuff. You know, help uh, assist with transportation and activities and lodging and things like that. And then the business that helped me live this life is the credit card service business. So if you own a business and you're still paying the credit card fees, you don't have to do that anymore. Stop wasting your money. You could be enjoying it every month instead of like whatever you're paying to the bank, a thousand, two thousand to the bank every month. You take it and go on a vacation. Look at the ocean, how beautiful it is down here. And the weather's perfect. It's so early in the morning, I'm already sweating, it's tropical. And uh, people are swimming down there, if you could see. And I, the only thing I wish that was down here is the that there was more waves. But like I said, if you own a business, uh, you don't have to pay for the fees. You can use it for vacation, take your family out, reinvest in your business, or whatever it is you want to do on with it. It's just, it's way better than wasting it, paying it to the bank and getting nothing in return, so. That's it. All right. That's it for now. Talk to you guys later. Adios.